Hey, John Burley here. I was asked a question the other day. It's a great question. They're like, John, how do you get so much done? You know, strategic planning is how we do it. So what I do is I have a list of the high priority items. Uh, most of my items I try and delegate when I can and then follow through until the people are really good at receiving the delegation. But I think the one thing that really helps the most is I keep track of what I do and what makes money. And essentially, you know, on the real estate investment side, there's three ways that we make money, and that's it, three. And it's not what most people do. Most people literally spend zero to two hours a week actually doing anything that makes money, some of while working 30, 40, 50 hours a week. So on the real estate investing side, look, there's three things. That's it, guys, just three. You know, the first one is making presentations to raise money. Probably the number one thing that everybody watching here needs to do is to raise more capital. So if I'm making a presentation face on face with somebody who could say yes, I'm in what I call the green zone and I'm making money. Whether they say yes or not, I'm in the green zone, I have proper activity. So that's number one. And that's where most people need to spend most of their time in the beginning. The second thing in the green zone is to make written offers for properties that I can buy. So not wishing and dreaming and tying property up that I can't close on, but actually having the funds and the ability to buy and making written offers, which today we've gotten way more aggressive, obviously, with the, the shift in the market over the last year. So making written offers, number two, that's what we do. Um, and so that be, should be something you do regular. One of the things I do also is I strive to get it done on Monday. So literally... I make my calls for capital on Monday because I get the monkey off my back. Because if you don't get the monkey off your back Monday or Tuesday, it becomes the 800-pound gorilla. And then the written offers, depending on how busy I am with capital raising, the written offers, those all need to go out by Tuesday. I can do more calls and more offers after Monday and Tuesday. But if I do my weekly numbers on Monday or Tuesday, I, I've already got a, a week that crushes the world and puts me so far ahead of most investors. And then the third thing that makes me money is showing properties I control – to remarket under my niche. So whether it's something I'm flipping or selling to a wholesaler or selling to an end user after I've renovated it or, you know, doing a traditional rental on it or doing a burly model owner financing, showing the property to somebody who's been pre-approved under your model for whichever niche you're doing, who has all the money and the ability to borrow, uh, ability to move. So in other words, an A buyer, somebody who's in, you know, needs to move in 30 to 90 days, has all of the money and has been fully approved. <laughs> and that's it. Anything else I do doesn't really make me any money. It's just fluff or super fluff or, in many cases, just a complete, total, absolute waste of time. Three things make you money, only three things. Wow, John, you left a lot of stuff about what about opening the mail? Doesn't make you a freaking penny. Well, what about answering the phones and returning phone calls to people who don't have money? Doesn't make you any money. <clears throat> what about, uh, you know, picking up my dry cleaning? What about taking my wife out to lunch? What about, you know, going to see my kids' games? All important things don't make you any money. What about looking at real estate online? Doesn't make you any money. What about putting up the signs? Doesn't technically make you the money. See, what we want to do is get you into the green zone. Reality is if I can get you to do two to four hours a week in the green zone, you'll start raising money right away, and then you'll start having offers accepted. Then you'll start having people who want to move into your properties that you've qualified and then we can work more. But what most people do who are real estate investors, if you really looked at it, almost every single thing they do is what I call red zone activity. It's not green zone. It doesn't make any money. You want to, as quickly as possible, go to the green zone, raise the money, get the placement fees, buy the properties, start making the cash flow and the income, fill the properties, and then start delegating out all that red zone crud that you think you're working, but you're not. CEOs don't do that stuff. People who make a million dollars a year don't do that stuff. You don't need to do that stuff either. Start Green Zone two to four hours every single week doing the three things that make you money. And then we'll see activity. We'll see results. So get out there and do it. Get in the Green Zone, guys. This is John Burley saying thank you. God bless. And hey, hop over to Instagram, John.Burley. Go to uh, Facebook. Follow us on our Facebook group, John Burley Real Estate Investing. It's a really active group, lots of great information, and feel free to ask questions, and we'll get right back to you. Uh, go to the website, johnburley.com. Free downloads for you right now. In addition, we're updating it constantly, and there's new information coming on board, plus information about our upcoming events. You can follow us there. Next thing we can do for you is right here on YouTube, um, johnburley.com. 
like us, subscribe to us, and really important, seriously, really important, put in the comments what you like, what you don't like, and more importantly, what you'd like me to teach you, because I'm willing to teach just about anything you'd like to know, but I can't read your mind. you got to let me know what it is. This is John Burley saying thank you, and God bless. Take care, guys.